explain some of them or not, but I just wanted to put them all together over here to just give you a visual of like how many brush you can fit into those things. And uh, there is like more than 150 brush over here right now. So this is a beautiful organizer for makeup brush. Look at this. All right, I don't remember exactly where I bought this one from because I had it for a long time and I will try to find it on somewhere online and see if I can find it. If I can, I will add the link in the description box. So this is going to be one of those pieces that um, I had for a long time and I just love it. The next thing that I want to share with you is a very little thing like it's so 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 inexpensive I don't even remember how much it was I think it was a dollar or less um, it's from Target I bought them in two different shapes one is this one and the other one is actually those ones which I still haven't unpacked so this is how I packed actually they were in the drawer and I just grabbed those things wrapped with the plastic so they're not all over the place in my luggage when I was moving so as you can see it even still has the tag on it I should take it off but yeah do you see that it's just so easy and it makes the drawer super organized now that I'm talking about this drawer organizers I have two more and they are also from a target I'm pretty sure, yeah, it says Room Essential. That's the Target brand, right? And they are super cheap. I don't remember how much it was. It doesn't say. And it's not the most sturdy thing on earth at all. It's just super flimsy. But you don't even need something like super sturdy for something in the drawer, you know? And the next two item is from Dollar Tree. So they're like a dollar and 25 cent each. Those are these little organizer things over here. So this is how it looks. It's pretty sturdy. I would say it's pretty sturdy. It's not gonna run around in your drawer. It has this little thing over here. I like that it has this little gray rubber kind of thing inside it. So it's really nice and cool. It's, it's pretty big though. It's like, look at that. It's about almost one hand. And I got like five of them. So the, this one is also like exact same thing, pretty much just a different shape and they're also $1.25 each. I got 10 of this. So here I have a 10 of this organizers and I have five of this one. So you know, something that goes inside the drawer, it doesn't have to be like super expensive. Um, it just has to be something neutral colors. It just goes with your vanity, like mine is white. So I just got all the white stuff to just give that neat clean look so those were all the essentials and organizing stuff that i wanted to share with you before i get into organizing the drawers and um yeah let's get started so here at first i took this very long organizer um and i put all my powder and blush on and a highlighter and this kind of stuff into this drawer and one thing i wanted to mention is that i actually decluttered a lot of my stuff when i was packing for the move um so that helped me a lot because i'm really one of those persons uh, like who doesn't like like too much stuff to just harding and um, just saving them and stuff like that i have a little bit of too much lipstick um i still give away a lot between my friends and families who doesn't mind to um take some of this old stuff that i have used probably once or twice for a video and i have never went back to it and some of the family members doesn't really care and it's really nice that they can actually get a use out of it so i love giving away this kind of stuff and just not to just let it sit in my drawer and go bad and just once just throw it in the bin so that's just super wasteful so i really like to do that um kind of stuff and one more thing i do not like to save for longer time is my eye product so you will see i have a very little very minimum like mascara and eyeliner this kind of stuff because 
those are very easy to get infection and get like bad and all those things so i just be very careful about that kind of stuff um so all my eyeliners and uh, mascaras that usually i buy my favorites and um, sometimes buy some new ones but it's just something i go through a lot and i always keep up with it so i don't have any old mascara or old eyeliner sitting in my drawers because those are just super dangerous um i think myself lipsticks i have a very hard time to let it go but i think i still do pretty good compared to the amount of lipstick that i buy this benefit the oreal mascara when it first launched i bought it right away and i love it and here is the tarted tardiest mascara this too is my current favorite right now this tarted tardiest mascara has been my favorite for a long time and as i have said before i don't have very much eye um, product like eye mascara and eyeliner if i open them and it's been uh, like five or six months i get rid of it um when it comes to eyeliner and mascara this is the two thing i'm try to be very careful uh here i'm sorting some of my um eyeshadow palette I couldn't finish all my beauty products organizing today but I did as much as I could um, till I got super tired. <laughs> and i will continue working on this and i will post a picture or maybe a tiny little video once i'm done with all those things to share with you guys that how it looks and maybe i will make another video to just show you guys that um once it's all done how it looks and thank you so much for watching i'll see you back again in another video bye bye